so guys here is a brief tutorial on how to uh, assemble the zero play guide for the Bosch PTS 10 table saw. So first thing you, you have to do is to print out those um, pre-printed parts that you can download on the Thingiverse website uh, and yeah this is how they look like and that one here is the top so it's been quite difficult to design those guys because the slots of the table saw are so, uh, so narrow so unfortunately the, the, the thickness I had to use uh, for the, the two half of the, the guys are quite uh, but anyway uh, it doesn't really matter because yeah, you know it's just a guide that doesn't need to be uh, tough or that does, need, that does not need any particular strength sorry for my bad English so The bottom plate, this is the stop block uh, to set up the, the guy with uh, zero plate. So you will need uh, three uh, and four holes with the counter countersign head. Three and four nuts. Two uh, and five. I will use uh, uh, M4 nuts, I think, I believe those are uh, I think maybe 10 millimeters uh, length nuts with counter sun head, but those one depends on the uh, application you will use. I mean, if you are using a uh, uh, thicker for example a uh, piece of wood on, on top of the, the guide will of course need the longer holes. Since the slots for the M4 nuts are pretty tight, the, the thing I do to uh, put them in is to just put close to the slot and then you take the M4 nut and tie it up like that and you will see that the slot the, the nut will to place. Same thing for the other two. Same thing for the top guy, so now you have to take the M5 nut, which you can push to it by hand, yeah, like so, okay, and then the other one, and push it right into place, buff, and yeah, that's pretty much everything. So now you will have have to first of all screw in without tightening the M4 now the holes leave it loose Next step is to put the 
stop block.